Of course, that one sat right next to the big one. Well, let's shift over a little bit and see if we can get within 80 of them. Hello everyone, welcome back to the Hunter Call of the Wild. This is the Hunter DD33. Today, we're going to be trying out the 12 gauge caver sham loaded with slugs on some bison. Now I've never hunted bison with slugs before so this is going to be interesting. Now where we're going to start is over here by Tichano and we're going to head over to this lake here and we'll head north to this lake. If we catch a heavy track, we're going to track it down and see if we can't find some big bison. Alright, so we just found a big herd of bison and they're right there. Let's see if we can find a decent sized male. There might be just a bunch of females from what it looks like from right now. But if there's this many bison, there should be a big decent male somewhere. Alright guys, so we haven't found anything besides that big group of female and I was looking for a big male and I just came across something that spooked in the woods here. And if you look right over here, actually right there it was, is a huge bison. He's a 4 easy 150 to I think it was like 220 or maybe 230s. I'm not 100% sure but he's big and he's right there. So we were actually headed over to this pond because this pond always has some really good sign of uh, bison. And I just caught a glimpse of this bison cut in this direction here. So luckily I've looked over and saw him cutting across. So now we just gotta find him. I think he's right there. I just saw what looks like it should be his back. I think that's him. He's 69 yards out. That's him, that's him. Yep, he's 69 yards out. He's definitely in range. Can we creep a little bit closer though and get a nice shot on him? I don't know. If he comes this direction, we could probably take a shot. I can see him cutting through to the right side there. Looks like he's trotting away again. He's actually bedded down like 25 yards away from us guys. I think we can make a shot on him. I'm pretty sure that's him. Let's check. That's definitely him. Perfect shot. Dropped him. Now, if I remember right, we should be at 100% integrity. I don't remember, but it is pretty risky. And I think we're gonna see if we can't find at least a female somewhere quick to make sure our consecutive harvest is at 100% before we pick this guy up. But for now, let's take a picture of him. And let's try and mark where we're at here. That should do. If we can't find that, then we have a problem. Oh, there we go. There we go. Just got a call from another bison over here. Let's see if we can't pick this one up quick and then come back over and see how big this one's going to be. That's a big bison. That's the biggest one I've seen in a long time. A 4 easy 150 plus bison. I mean, he's pretty much guaranteed gold. But I want to make sure our consecutive harvest is at 100%, which it should be. Oh, there's a bison right there. I see it. I'm not sure if that's the one that just called from before. Oh, what the heck? Did it spook? Oh, come on. Oh, no, he's right there. 52 yards out. Come on. There's actually like a hill right there. So if we would have taken a shot, it would have hit that hill. And that wouldn't be good. So we're just going to creep forward a little bit closer. See if we can get within 30 of them and take a shot. I don't even know if it's a male or a female or what, but we'll just pretend like it's a big male again. So we're going to go for a perfect shot. The wind is sort of blowing right towards them. That's kind of the reason why. I think it keeps noticing us. Oh, 
Although it seems like we're getting pretty close. And he's not really noticing us. At least I hope he's not. I don't see him though. Is that him? Uh, no, that's a rock. There he is. Oh, come on. Two hits isn't going to bring you down. Apparently it will. Yeah, like I said, I don't even know if this is a big male or a female or what, but we're going to pick it up just to see what it is. It was a big male, a really big male. And luckily we kept our consecutive harvest at 100%. By taking two shots, we got two lung hits with the 12 gauge slug. That was almost a heart shot, look at that. When it charged us, we almost made a perfect heart shot on him. He scored 158, it was a silver because it didn't drop completely. It probably would have been close to a gold. He was a three very easy and 158 score, total score of 712. And we got 997 cash for that. I think I just saw another bison over there, but let's pick him up. He scores 203 gold. Made an awesome spine and right lung shot at 18 yards. I think he was just like this. And he basically turned to see what was going on and got whacked. So yeah, he was just like this. We made a perfect spine lung shot on him. And we got 1,059 cash, 234 XP, and a huge gold bison. All right, so we just heard another bison right over here. I couldn't tell if it was a male or a female, but it definitely put out some kind of a, a bison call in this direction. Where would he be? Oh, right there, right there. Uh, I can't quite spot it. Come on. Come on, it's 43 yards out though. Nothing. 51 yards out. Bad wind. I can't spot him. Tell you what, we don't really need to spot him. We're just going to go for a shot. If he's at 50 yards, we'll take a shot at 50 yards. Two hits into him, and he's down the second shot. Wow, this 12 gauge works fantastic. So, yeah, I don't even know what it is. Let's check this track to possibly see what it might be. The fact that it was alone makes me think it might have been a male. <laughs> it is a big male, too. So, it's a really good thing we took two shots. The big males seem like they're always all alone. A really cool bison. Let's take a picture of them. Awesome picture. All right, let's pick him up. See who he's going to score. He scores 149, 100% everything. Uh, total score of 745, so he wasn't quite big enough to be a gold. He was a three very easy, but still really nice bison. A really cool looking size bison. We made a left lung and lower neck shot. The first shot actually was a single lung. We took him when he was quartering right at us, and you can see just how much power the 12 gauge slug has. Goes right through that shoulder blade, no problem at all, and hit the left lung. Then the second shot we took as he was pretty much coming at us and we hit him in the lower neck and well that pretty much ended him the shot was actually 42.57 yards and this one was 42.79 yards we got 1016 cash and 211 xp on that bison all right so we just got eyes on a medium-sized male bison he's right there went for a spine shot and i think we got it well actually it was more of a neck spine shot but i'll take it I don't even know how big he is. He looked pretty decent. And uh, I think he was a male at least. Let's check. Yeah, he scores 116. Uh, total score of 690. He was a male, two minor. And we made a spine shot. Perfect shot. Actually, it looks like we pulled off a little bit to the right, but still caught that spine. And uh, we ended up getting 991 cash for him. So we just found a red deer, and he's out here 100 yards out. I don't have the red deer collar on us. 
But we might try and zero in for 80 and take a shot. If we could possibly get a clearing of him. Because he's in some pretty thick brush right there. I don't know if that's going to happen. Oh, right there, right there. Okay, he's 70. We're zeroed in for 54. <laughs> Solid hit on him. I think we hit him right in the front shoulder. But look at the percentage drop on that. 25 to 50%. And he should go down right away, so that was pretty cool. We were zeroed in for 50, and I held it pretty much for the spine shoulder, and it should have dropped in there nice and got a single lung at least. And as you can see, it was a vital hit. He ran off in this direction here. Yeah, I've never seen the percentage go down that fast before. That was pretty cool. So he should be down. Here he is down right here. Nice. He probably ran maybe 45, 50 yards. Not even. And here he is down here. It was just a medium-sized red deer, but still pretty cool. This is my first red deer with the 12-gauge slug, so let's see what happens. Wow, 100% integrity. I wasn't sure if we would get 100% for that or not. And we made a 70-yard right lung hit on him. So awesome shot. We were holding it for the top of the uh, lung spine area, and it looks like it dropped about 4 inches which is pretty good. I'll take that. I'll definitely take that all day long. And he scored 94, total score of 642, and we got 1,312 cash for that. So as you can see, we'll get a ton of cash with the 12-gauge um, slug, so that's really cool. Wow, it looks like they did a really good job with the mold of this red deer. For some reason, it looks almost better than all the others. It looks way better than the geese, that's for sure. So we just found a really nice herd of bison, and what is this? Just saw another bison, right? That is definitely not a bison. <laughs> Alright, so there's a wild boar coming right towards these bison that we're trying to put a sneak on. And there's a big male right in the back. I don't think I can spawn him from here, but he's right. He's right between these two. He's that one right there. There he is. Okay, that's him right there. We do have him at 50 yards out exactly. And there's a little opening to take a shot. Oh. They're all standing up. Oh, come on. Don't do that. All right. So we finally caught up to our big male bison. He's right. I think that's him. No, that's not him. Anyways, he's one of these bison. He's in a group of a bunch of females. That's him. Come on. Slow down. Oh, perfect. They bedded right there. Well, at least most of them did. Uh, if only we could find the big male. I think he's probably the one right behind. Look at this. How are we supposed to get to the big male? With all these other bison right on top of us. If that one moves, that might help. Is that him? Found him! Found him! He's right there! 94 yards out! Oh, perfect. Come on. Don't move. Don't move. Don't move. Don't move. Move. Oh! This little one just sat down right next to the big one and blocked our shot. Oh, of course that one sat right next to the big one. Well, let's shift over a little bit and see if we can get within 80 of them. All right, 92. 91. 90. So we're at 90. Shot looked really good. Oh, look at the percentage going down. Perfect shot. Eighty-five yards, probably eighty-five yards, maybe ninety. And we just dropped that big male bison with the twelve gauge and one slug. I'm surprised that that actually happened. Wow, what a shot! Must have been a spine shot. I don't think it dropped at all because we were holding pretty much right on the spine, and I guess he was eighty. So, let's pick him up. He scores 187 gold. So, we ended up getting another gold. And look at that shot. Perfect shot. Caught the bottom of the spine. And it was 88 yards. We got 100% integrity on that. Total score of 810. And another big gold bison. All right, guys. Well, I think that's going to be the end of this video. So, I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching. And we'll see you next time. That's a monster.
159 to 213 score estimate and 187 to 220 pounds on that buck. Let's go with that and let's pick him up. Oh my god! A 210 scoring diamond whitetail buck. I can't believe he was that big. 